Hey everyone here, Ferris with art to life uh, I actually just moved, so you're literally looking at the one part of my room that's suitable for uh, human viewing. <laughs> Everything else is uh, pretty much a mess right now. But um, while I'm moving, you know, and while I haven't been able to really paint a lot, um, well, really at all, just because, you know, moving, um, <clears throat> I've been thinking about, like, what have what have I done over this past year with my art, you know, that helped me get some breakthroughs? What were, what were some things I did that help me move my practice forward. The one thing I came up with, it's, it's, it's you know, sort of deceptively simple, but uh, one thing I did differently, which um, had a huge impact on my art, was actually going out and um, taking photos of my friends. Um, I've, I'm a representational painter and I love painting people, but I've always had sort of this uh, trepidation, this sort of uh, the fear, uh, which ultimately proved me pretty silly about going out and asking people to, you know, if they would model for me. It's, I think I'd worked it up in my head that there was going to be this, you know, very intense, intimate thing, and it can be that, which is great, but I just, I had so much fear around it that I really didn't know how to move forward. And it wasn't until I started talking with other, you know, artist friends of mine, they're like, yeah, dude, just go ahead and do it. Um, and that was a huge breakthrough. Um, not only were the photo shoots super fun, uh, just a lot of fun, um, you get so much great content out of them, but also it made the art better, frankly. Um, and that was, you know, that was always the goal, but I was surprised at how quickly it made the, the work better. That That's just a, a breakthrough that I had uh, throughout this last year. And um, and now, now I have like a whole folder in my, uh, you know, uh, my G drive um, of just uh, like different different ideas for photo shoots and other photo shoots I've had. So I'm not at a loss for content anymore, which is great. Um, but so I guess I want to put that question to you. What have you done? Um, it doesn't have to be recent. It can be really anything you can think of um, that's been a breakthrough in your your practice and your 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 art. And again, this can be something big. It could be something small. It could be you know if you paint representationally or, or reference things from life. Um, maybe it's that you took more photos like I did, or you know, maybe it's that you tried a different technique, or maybe it's that you shared your work for the first time, or the second time, or the third time, or the fifth time, and and that was something that. Um, that really helped push you forward. Um, or it could be, you know, I try to do paintbrush, something like that. Um, there's no wrong answers here. Uh, and also, if you don't have a breakthrough, maybe there's something here that you've been thinking about that you've wanted to do, but you haven't, um, for whatever reason, um, you know, mine, I was just, I was just scared. That's really what it came down to. But, uh, you know, for some, maybe you just don't have time, you, know, you haven't had time to explore this thing yet. But um, if you haven't had a breakthrough yet, maybe in the comments section uh, in this vlog here, um, to let us know what it is you want to have happen in your art, what, what you want your breakthrough to be. This subject is actually very uh, pertinent to the podcast coming out this Wednesday. Uh, Nick talks about this subject a lot in a lot more uh, depth and detail uh, than I can manage here in this little vlog. Um, <clears throat> and you can find um, links to where you can watch the podcast and subscribe to it as well uh, in the notes here in this vlog. Um, also, for those of you who are um, interested in seeing more of my work, just to get an idea, um, you can actually really see a pretty clear point where uh, I started doing, uh, you know, painting more um, from photos, uh, from like photo shoots that I had done. It's pretty, pretty funny, that demarcation, and at least I find it to be pretty stark, but you can... Um, Find links to my website, my Instagram, uh, in the notes on this vlog as well. Can't wait to see what y'all write, and I hope y'all have a happy Sunday. Okay, take care. Hey everyone, if you found this helpful, I have a whole lot more to teach, share, and inspire you with every single week. So join the Art to Life YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button below. Okay, let's do this. Awesome.